Hello everyone, I'm back at it again. <laughs> this is the fastest road to a million and today I have ticket number 13. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna be lucky or unlucky, but I'm hoping lucky. Let me see if I can get it on the clipboard. Get it in frame. Oh, I have my little kitty here. So hopefully it will be lucky. This is a keychain. I I use it a little differently. I guess you could use it both ways, but I take the ring and I put it around the strap of my purse so it doesn't fall off. And then if I run in the store, I'll take and clip my keys on here just to hold it temporarily. Then I'll have to dig through my purse for the keys. Or if I go in a restaurant, just, you know, if I'm picking up something, I need to put my keys somewhere and I don't want to hold them constantly. Or you could use it differently and you could put your keys on this ring permanently and just use this clip and clip it on your purse if you have a place to clip it where it would stay securely. But I would worry about it. I would bump it and knock it off. So I put this one around it, around the strap. And it stays on permanently. I get a lot of compliments when I go places. Went to the bank the other day and the teller had one of these little kitties that was miniature. It was only about a fourth of this size, but hers was a necklace that she was wearing. So she noticed right away that I had the match to hers. Oh well, I know, gotta get busy. But guys, if you wanna buy your girl something, I'm sure they would appreciate a nice little thing like that. And they do come in different animals, not just cats. You can get others. Uh, I think I also have a unicorn. Okay, we are going to scratch. And this time, I want to start at the bottom. <laughs> and then we'll work our way up. We're looking for the money bag. We have a diamond, a moon, cherries. A double dollar sign and a ring. I don't know if I'm ever gonna find that money bag down there. I think I did one time and I think it was $10. <laughs> I need more than that. I wanna go shopping and get something nice. Okay, let's symbol hunt. I don't do that a lot, but I do like to do it sometimes. If I can find the numbers, I got 61 and 55, 3, 54, 31, 47. Like I said, I would love to see that 200X. That's the symbol I'm looking for. Got a 42, 14, 16. But if I don't find that one, I would take the 2X, the 5X, or the 10X, or maybe even the 20X. Maybe with the 20X, I could get at least a hundo. 21, 13, 
52, a 9, 56, 15, 22, an 8, a 63. Come on, symbols. I need a symbol. 36. 48, 64, last one, 46. Okay, no symbols on this ticket. Let's see what we can find at the top. 17. Let me get a little bigger. I hope you can see it. Because you know me, I miss them. I depend on you to help me find them. Okay, do you see a 17? I see a 15 and a 13. Okay, well, I don't see that one. Let's try the next one. 35. I see a 38. And I see a 36. Let's try the next one. 25. I see a 22 and a 28. Fifty-one. I see fifty-two. Nineteen. No, I see a twenty-one. Lonely one, where are you? <laughs> no, I have an eleven. Okay. 33. I have a 31. No 33. Last one. And it's a 7. And I don't think I have a 7 on here. Wow. Ticket 13. You let me down. So 7 was a Sammy between 6 and 8. Okay. Hope you guys are having a good day. Get out there, find that big winning ticket, and go claim it. Because you can go to the lottery office, but you do have to make an appointment. So find a big claimer. Good luck to you. Bye-bye.